My name is Eric and I come from Stockholm in Sweden. Um, and I'd like just to first take a bit back to um, get a, give you a bit of context. Um, um, I had a really happy childhood up until I was about nine. And I got to know that my mother was going to die within a few years. Um, so when I was 11, my mother died from a disease. And I spent um, my teenage years uh, with a lot of avoidance, indulgence, and replacing of all the data stream that brings with sorrow and uh, hate and everything. So when I was 20, I got into quite a big depression. And I spent about four years of um, psychotherapy. Um, and then I um, discovered alternative ways of dealing with it. So I, um, different kind of spiritual practices and so forth for about three and a half years. And um, this was about one and a half years ago and I met the training. And um, my life has really shifted in so many ways. I, I like to share a few of the benefits that I've received. And um, what I can see is that, for example, in work, um, I work as an art director. And uh, in my work life, I can really see how I'm much more solution oriented than I was before. Um, I can just see that I have like a really natural leadership role. Um, and I can really contribute with my strengths, gifts and talents in so many ways to my colleagues and it's all over the world. So um, I, I see that I'm, I have much more clarity in terms of how I take decisions. Everything is just so much more efficient because I can really see what is of most benefit. Um, and, and in terms of relationships, both to people but also to places and things, I just see how the training has brought so much of um, really a sense of well-being and that all is well no matter if people love me or um, they don't love me or whether I have lots of things or not so much things and whether I'm in Stockholm or whether I'm here. I just see how a lot of that longing to have a special situation has, has vanished in many ways. Um, I, I find to, to, my, uh, uh, to my relatives, to my family, I'm, it's just such a more underlying sense of love and compassion for them and I want to help them in any way I can. And also to, in my, especially in the relationship to myself, I, uh, I just see how, how it's so much more loving. I, I'm just so much more relaxed with all the things that's going on. I have a special, I have a disposition like everyone has and, and I've just become more and more relaxed with the way that I really am and I can really just gone from like, I love how that said in, uh, in the training that like the basis, what, what you get at the door is sort of um, li total life satisfaction and and complete well-being and then from that on it's just to see how I can be of benefit to, to myself and others. So I can see how my life nowadays is much more about how I can contribute with my strengths, gifts and talents in different ways. Um, and and um, I do that um, through using the Four Mainstays. So in terms of short moments, it's I love it. It's so I love how the simplicity of the training, how how this simple instruction just brings me back to, to seeing that everything is well. Um, and I just see also that it's become more and more continuous and I use it when I need to. But it's also continuous when I immerse myself in the mainstays. So the training, I've done training since day one. I did the, the empowerments after about three or four weeks after meeting the training. It was so powerful. It's really like, as I've said, the like the best gift I've ever given to myself because that gave me access to the entire training of the entire array of the four mainstays. Um, I've, I've just been in training for a lot of time going to Bristol, going to, to uh, Goa, this is the second season I'm here, going to, to the Swedish Centre for a longer time and, and also spending a lot of time in the Stockholm community where we have a lot of trainings locally. I also listen to a lot of uh, talks. I do like a morning routine where I make breakfast and listen to talks and, and uh, 
during lunch listen to talks. I just have it on whenever I can. Um, in terms of the trainer, it's like nothing I've ever had before. A person who can totally empower me and just give personal recommendations of what is most powerful for me to gain assurance and open intelligence. It's, yeah, it's the single most important relationship in my life, I would say. Um, in terms of the community, um, I just love you all so much. It's, uh, it's amazing to, to spend life in this way. Um, I've never been in a situation where I, there's so much love for people who I've barely met. Um, and everyone, uh, just coming from Open Intelligence, there's just so much respect and love and compassion for each other. So I, I really sense that. And, and um, yeah, I'm, I'm very engaged both in locally in Stockholm where, where we do a lot of events and hang out and live together in, in a really nice way and also coming here and really intensifying the training. So um, it's really, um, yeah, it's, it's the best thing I've ever, I've ever found. I wouldn't want to change it for anything in the world.